Hi, I'm Stephanie Ricca, Editor-in-Chief of Hotel News Now, here reporting from day two of the NYU conference with my colleague, news editor Sean McCracken. So Sean, a lot going on today, a lot going on at this conference. I think the best way to characterize it is by citing something that Mitch Shaw from Noble Investments mentioned this morning. He brought back that, anal that analogy of the industry being more like a cricket match than a baseball game, but the way he described it was funny. He said, you know, like a cricket match, no one really understands the rules, no one quite knows what's about to happen, but there are some periods where you get a lot of runs that might be followed by some periods of a minor slowdown. So I thought that was kind of a fun way to describe where we are in the cycle. Yeah. And it seems like that kind of anxiety and confusion about what's going on has kind of pushed some people to the sidelines or at least made them a little more reticent about making big moves. Um, I think if there's any theme from, from this week at NYU, it's that people are recognizing this is not the time to just sit and wait things out. You've got to accomplish things, even if we, even if things seem a little hazy, if we don't know if it's going bad, it's going to stay good, whether that be through uh, Jonathan Tisch's call to engage actors in Washington, whether that is, you know, the myriad brand launches we've had over the past couple of days. People are trying to accomplish something uh, as opposed to just wait to see if this is the right timing. I couldn't agree more. And that proactivity really covers so many bases. Not only, like you said, are people launching brands, they're talking about tech innovations, they're talking about wellness, they're talking about labor issues. You know, it's really been one of those conferences where the conversation is about so many different topics, not just one controlling theme. So it's been interesting and fun, and we're gonna sign off today from day two of the NYU Hospitality Conference here in New York City. See more on hotelnewsnow.com.